Hi, I'm Steve Adubato right here at St. Barnabas Medical Center. I am pleased to be joined by Dr. Allison Grant, who is chair of the Department of Radiation Oncology here at St. Barnabas. Doctor, good to have you with us. Thank you so much for having us. One of the first things I'm curious about, I know that people watching are curious about as well, the center here at St. Barnabas, how is it different from other centers who do the same thing or say they do the same thing? I think there are a lot of departments that focus only on technology. Radiation oncology is a highly technological field, but at St. Barnabas Medical Center, we take a team approach of taking care of not only the medical side of the patient, but the whole patient, um, social, medical, um, integrating the highest technology and looking at the patient as an individual. No uh, two patients are the same. We really. Uh, we really recognize that cancer, even the same diagnosis in no, no two patients is the same. Well, let's stay on that because you seem to be really talking about the multidisciplinary approach that may, may sound jargony to some people. What does it actually mean? Give us an example of the so-called multidisciplinary approach right here at Barnabas. Well, in terms of cancer care, we have multiple multidisciplinary tumor boards. So if a patient, for tumor example, boards. tumor boards, I'm going to start with that, where sure. we have conferences where all of our patients are discussed with the group of medical oncologies, the group of surgeons that's particular to that diagnosis, and a group of radiation oncologists. We work as a team to define the best treatment approach for all of our patients as individuals. In the Department of Radiation Oncology, we have a staff of physicians um, trained at the best institutions. Harvard Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center and we also work as a team for each case that's being discussed or presented to make sure that we um, don't left any stone in turn. We think about the entire care of the patient. Um, many centers don't work as collaboratively with their colleagues. We work very collaboratively with medical oncology and surgical oncology as well. One of the things that many people have heard about is that, I mean there are different centers or other centers that, um, that say they're freestanding centers that may not have the multiple, multiple uh, disciplinary approach that may not have the comprehensive care that you have here at St. Barnabas. But there are some safeguards that are also in place here that protect the patient. Talk about that. Absolutely. So we have phenomenal equipment. We basically can offer our patients um, any modern technology from IMRT, Ooh, IMRT, intensity modulated radiation therapy, which is one of the things that actually ends up in the news for radiation therapy errors. What we do for all of our patients is we have five full-time physics staff, two PhD physicists and three dosimetrists, also well-trained from great institutions in the country. Every case for our patients, um, every morning we basically present every patient before they are treated, their treatment plan, with all of the physicians, the physics staff, the chief radiation therapist, nurses, and psychosocial support. Those cases are presented to make sure that everyone is in agreement with, with, with what the physician has decided to choose. Before the first treatment, mm -hmm. we basically do a dry run on the machine where we pretend to treat the patient before the machine is actually turned on to make sure when that machine is turned on that there are no errors in delivery. And then throughout the course of treatment, we're constantly paying attention to the fact that um, all safeguards are in place. But Dr. Grant, I just want to be clear. Not not, not, not lucky to be critical of anyone yeah. else, but not everyone does that. No, most places don't even have a, many places don't even have a full-time physicist on staff or a full-time dosimetrist on staff. They work part-time. They definitely don't present every case prior to treatment. So for you, yes. to be the head of a team like this, how rewarding is that? Oh, I, I feel so blessed to work in my department. I would let any of my partners take care of me. I would let the radiation therapist and the physicist take care of me. Or a family member. Or a family member.